Today I'm going to walk you through a simple side hustle you can do from anywhere in the world, part time, even if you've never made a dime online. I'll show you exactly how to do it. Basically what we're doing is we're helping local business owners. We're giving them push button simple systems and in return we can charge them three to five hundred dollars or more per month. Now before you freak out, I don't have a thousand dollar course or a mastermind or anything to sell you in this video. I just want to walk you through exactly how to do it and if you hit the like button and leave a comment down below, I'll actually give you a full three hour plus course walking you through exactly what I do in extreme detail and I'll even give you a free 30-day trial to the software that I use to do all of this. So let me walk you through how this works. So the tool that we're using today is a software called High Level. And what I love about High Level is if you notice on the screen, you don't see High Level anywhere on the page. That's because High Level is a full-fledged business software. It does all kinds of crazy things. I'll show you one thing that we're gonna do to help business owners today. But you'll notice up here I have a brand profitably. Now High Level has let me what's called white label their software, meaning I can put my own logo, change the colors, figure out what kind of features I want to offer, and then market this as my own software. And I keep all of the profit beyond what I pay high level every single month, which is only $4.97 per month is the max that you would pay. Most people start out on the $97 per month plan, so it's incredibly affordable. And again, I'll give you a free 30-day trial. If you hit the link down below, you'll get my free course, and I'll give you the link to try it out for 30 days. But let me walk you through how we're going to find people in this case, to help them get a new website, and we're going to have High Level do 95% of the work to create this website. Okay, so here's where we're going to actually find people that actually need a website, just by going to Google like any other day, and we're just going to search for something like Roofers Near Me. And up here are sponsored ads. These are Google Guaranteed ads. We're going to skip that and go down to this section here, and then we're going to hit More Businesses. Now if we scroll down here, Google will actually tell us what businesses don't have a website. You can see website here, website, website, here's Apex Roofing Solutions, no website listed. So I would make a note of that, make a little list of, of these businesses. Okay, so they have a website, they have a website. Sometimes you got to go to the page two or page three of this and you'll start finding more and more because if you have a website, then obviously Google's going to rank you higher in a lot of cases. Okay, here's another one, Eddie's Roofing Construction. They have 66 reviews, but no website listed, so I'd write that one down. And we're just going to go page by page and find a list of 10 or 20 of these, so we know we at least have a list of people we can go after once I show you the next step, which is really easy to do. Okay, here's another one, Mercia's Roofing. Another one, Buddy's Roofing and Construction. Your Roofer Pro LLC. Quality Roofing and Contracting advanced roofing and repair and that's probably five or six of them so we have enough but what I would do if I were you is just go through and find 10 or 20 of these so you have a full list of prospects you can go after because the next step we're going to create a website one time and then use that as the tool that we use to prospect each of these and eventually sell it to one of them okay and then inside of high level you can see we have something called a prospecting tool which is over here and I can actually do a similar thing in here but it gives me a little more data that I can use so I'm gonna do roofers in Katy, Texas, which is where I am. And then what it will do, it takes a little while to load, but it will tell you, do they have a Google business profile listed? Do they have a WordPress website? You can see by that little check mark there. And then it'll tell you the likelihood of the conversion rate, meaning how likely are they to need your services that you can do with high level. So this one's 35%. Uh, Integrity Roofing ha uh, does not have a WordPress site. So it probably doesn't have a chat widget and things like that. So that's some things that we could look at. Let's just scroll through a couple more here. Okay, you can see this Ortega Brothers Roofers LLC has a 75% likely and also this Valdez Family Roofers LLC. Both of those uh, looks like they have a website but let's see if it's any good. Okay, here is their website. You can see, I mean, at least they have one but it's pretty plain. I mean, it's not very convincing. There's no pictures. There's not really anything that's enticing me to to want to hire them to do my roof and then I came across this other one too this five star uh, this is for an AC company but you can kinda see a lot of these local business owners even if they do have a website maybe you pull a list and you find that you only find a, a handful that don't have a website then start clicking on some of the websites and see okay is the website any good are there any conversions like this phone number even is kinda weird I don't know if they're gonna get many calls there um, and it looks like none of these these look like buttons but they're not buttons and I can't scroll down any further either so it's 
not the best website. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to rebuild a couple of these really quickly. So we'll do an AC site and a roofing site. I'll show you how easy it is to do in high level. Even if you don't have a lot of tech skills, it's super simple to do in a couple clicks. And then I'll show you how we would go out and start prospecting for this. Okay, so we're back inside of our high level account. And all we're going to do is over here, we're going to go to sites. And then we're going to either do a funnel or a website. Typically for a local business, we're going to do a website because it has multiple pages and it, they kind of all work together. Funnels are more for like a one page landing page or a couple pages that work together to sell one specific thing. But the, the websites I, I find are a lot more useful for a local business. So all we do is we hit new website here. And we can either do one from blank, which the, bel the builder is really easy to use, but we're actually going to use the templates here. So hit continue. And then let's, for the first one, let's just do roofer or roofing. And let's see, let's just go with this one. You can hit the little eyeball and see if it's one you want to use, but I've used this one in the past, so I like it. And then we're just going to hit continue. It's going to build the entire website, so I'll show you all of that in a second once it loads here. But it basically in the background, it's setting up all the pages, all the pictures. It's pulling in some content. I'll show you how easy it is to rewrite content in a moment too. But it's basically going to create an entire website for us right here behind the scenes. It opens up right here, so we don't even have to click anything. And you can see, I'll just do a preview of it real quick. So you can see we have a picture of a roof here. It's already got kind of the layouts and the different buttons and things here, different services, frequently asked questions, you can have a little spot for reviews, and then a footer down here. So majority of the work is done. Okay, it already has the menu, everything is done. If we go to some of these other pages, let's see. Okay, so the way that this one is built is it's kind of like a, a one page site. It has a couple other pages on it, but basically if you click any of these uh, sections, it will bring you to a different spot in the website, which is really cool. It just makes it a lot easier, uh, especially for you to edit when you're trying to pitch this. So you can see it has a little spot for a logo up here. I'm going to bring you over to the builder and just show you how easy it is to edit some of this stuff in case somebody does want to work with you. So if we just go to the page here, we're going to hit edit. And then what was the name of the company? It was Ortega Roofers. So we would just do Ortega Roofers, simplified roofing. And then we could get a little logo made in Canva or something and put it up here. Or if Ortega Roofers had a logo, which they doesn't look like they do, um, we could put it up there as well. And you would just tap here. And then over here, where it says brand logo, you're just going to swap it out with whatever their, their logo is. But since they don't have one, um, then we would just either create one or, or leave that up here as just logo here. But that's basically it. We might change a, a little bit about their company, maybe put their phone number on here. But pretty much, if we just hit save and then preview, we can see that the site is pretty much done. Obviously, we can go in and edit a few things. Let me show you one other thing with the uh, AI editor as well. So if we go inside of here and let's just say... We wanted to change all of this text. It already kind of has some information at Ortega Roofing. Uh, we are more than just a roofing company. We are trusted partners. But say we didn't like any of that stuff. We wanted to, to customize it. We could just highlight all of this, hit this little AI button, generate with AI, write why people should work with Ortega Roofers. Writing tone, I like to do sometimes professional, sometimes funny, just depending on the scenario. And I'll do three variations. And in a matter of seconds, it's going to generate a section here uh, that we can put into, into the text. So it says, maximize roof's potential with Ortega roofers, unmatched craftsmanship, reliability uh, for your peace of mind. So these are kind of short. I might rewrite these and make them a little longer. Okay, so it generated a couple more. They're not too long, but let's just copy it and paste it in there and you can see now it's replaced that so maybe we would go back and undo that but overall you can see you can rewrite all the content in here if you want to but it already has a majority of the content already done so I love how easy it is to go through and build this let me save this and then I'll build one more within the uh, HVAC air conditioner type of niche Okay, so here we are back in here and all we do is hit new website and we're going to click on from templates and hit continue and then we're going to do HVAC and I usually like this blue one so we'll pick that and hit continue 
And within a matter of a few seconds, it's going to build that site in the background. And then we'll, I'll show you in a moment how we go out and start prospecting and showing this to potential business owners. You can see it's already done. It's got all the sections built out. If we compare that to what we were uh, competing against, you know, the, I can't even scroll down here to get to this stuff down here if there is anything else. The phone number I'm not quite sure about. Uh, looks like there's couple other pages here but to contact them is quite difficult uh, I just clicked on recent jobs and it's a page full of of nothing so if we hit contact at least there's a form to fill out um, but that's it okay compared to this isn't the most beautiful site right but we'll preview it here I mean it's a, f a big difference from what we are are seeing there obviously we got a little text we got to clean up here but overall the site layouts done if you are a web designer you might be saying this is a terrible looking site but for somebody who doesn't know how to build anything uh, it's a pretty easy to to use system here okay so we have the two sites basically done we change out the logo we'd add the phone number and things but overall it's pretty much done so we're gonna go out and start reaching out to these local business owners Okay, so what I would do is then just find, I would Google some of these. Sometimes you'll see that they don't have a website, but they do have a social media account, which is great. So we can message them there, or you can just do the brave thing and pick up the phone and call them because uh, there's not any other way to reach them. Okay, so let's see if this is it. Okay, so this could be it, Advanced Roofing Houston, but it looks like when we Googled it, they didn't have a website connected, and I'm not even sure if this is the same company. Advanced Roofing and Repair, let's see. Advanced Roofing Solution, so it's different. Okay, so for this, I would just pick up the phone and call them and just say, hey, there's some confusion. There's another company that's similar to yours. I didn't even see that you had a website. Uh, do you have a website? And they say, oh, no, I don't have one, or, or yeah, I'm working on it, or whatever they say. I say, well, great. Uh, I actually built one for you. I think it looks amazing, and I just want to show you it, see if it's something you would even be interested in. I already have it done, so I could send you over a link. Obviously, I need to fill in a little bit more information, but I could just show you the basics of it. And if you want to move forward, great, we can talk about it. If you don't, no problem. I can probably redo it for one of your uh, competitors in the area. And that's what I would do. And I would just go down the list and start talking to them, and you'll be very nervous when you first start if you haven't done a lot of cold calling and things, but you'll start seeing that... Um, eventually you get somebody that says yes so then once we do get somebody that says yes we can actually either do a loom video like I'm doing right now and just walk them through that site or what we can do is build out the site a little bit just build like the first page or so with their actual logo or create a logo for them in Canva make sure all the the sections and everything work and then we reach out to them uh, send them the link or ideally meet them over zoom and show them the website and then as far as pricing goes and the way that we beat this up from something that's worth maybe 50 or 100 bucks a month to something that's worth a few hundred dollars a month let me show you a few things that we can add to this okay, so if we look at their site the only way that I could basically contact them is by calling them and a lot of people don't want to call they want to get their questions answered so they're gonna scroll down a little bit they're gonna see this, this I don't even know if this company is still in business and they're gonna bounce they're gonna leave right but what we could do is put a little chat widget down in the bottom right corner, which will give them an opportunity to have somebody start texting with their business back and forth. So let me show you how easy it is to add a chat widget. So here we are inside of the sample site that we built for them. You can see there's no chat widget right now, but all we have to do is go into our high level dashboard here. We're going to go to settings and for chat widget, we're just going to tap this little link and, and put default chat widget and hit save. Now when I go back to the site, and I refresh, we should have a chat widget that pops up in just a second. Bam, there it is. Hi, have any questions? Text us here. You can change the color of this and everything, so I might go back and make that red. Um, but basically, now they have a way for people to interact with them. And the way that they receive those leads is everything goes into an app on their phone, or they can log in on their computer. But a lot of business owners, especially roofers, contractors, people that are out in the field a lot, they want to be able to get the text on their phone. So somebody's going to fill out this name, email, um, and phone number and message and then that is going to go to the business owner and they can either respond themselves or if we want to beef this up even more you can turn on AI functionality so let me show you that okay so we're in our settings for this this account and all we're going to do is tap on this conversation AI and then what we can do is when somebody chats with that business owner we can do what's called autopilot mode 
and if we turn this on for the chat widget, that means that when somebody chats in with the business owner, then AI can respond to those people. So you can really turn this from something that is $50 a month to something that is several hundred dollars a month by basically saying, hey, Mr. Business Owner, looks like you have a site that probably isn't getting you a ton of leads right now. What if we install this new entire lead generation system where not only can you have people that are going to come to your website and the site's going to look great and be trustworthy, but when they chat in, obviously you're out on a lot of jobs, so you, don't may, you may not have the time to respond to those people. What if we could have AI respond and answer all of their questions and then you would be notified after a conversation is done what that person actually needed done? So you can turn all the tire kickers and everybody that was just testing the waters and filter those out and then just only talk to the people that you know really need your help. And we can test this out. There's a lot of other things I'll do in future videos on how to turn this thing on and make it work really well. But you can train the bot based on uh, all the things that are pertinent to that particular business. It's really easy to do with this bot training. You can test it and make sure everything is working. You can, If it gives a response that you don't like, you can train it by giving it a thumbs up or a thumbs down. If you give it a, give it a thumbs down, then you would teach it how you would want it to respond in that case. So I'll do more videos of that in the future. But I think that this is a great way for you to turn something that you could typically sell for 50 bucks all the way up to several hundred dollars and it really didn't take you that long to do and more importantly it's going to provide an incredible service for this local business actually getting them leads coming in the door and uh, converting those leads into actual customers versus right now I'm sure they're missing a lot of phone calls and and having a lot of people that are trying to get them to do their roof in this case but they're not responding or not responding fast enough so that's what i got for you guys today there's a ton of stuff on the channel about this as well make sure you hit the like button and leave a comment down below and i'll give you an entirely free course exactly how to do this step by step it's like a three hour course so uh, if you want that hit the like button leave a comment down below if you don't know what to say just say love the content would love your free course and i'll personally respond to you and give that to you so with that i'm going to wrap up i'll see you on the next video thanks